So what is the uh, learning analytics? So uh, learning analytics is a measurement, a collection, analysis, and reporting data about learners and context for the purpose of understanding and not optimizing yeah, learning and environment. So the goal of the uh, learning analytics is, I think, to maximize yeah, learners' learning gains, like uh, scores, not only scores, but also like creativity or like some uh, attitude, <laughs> something like that. And then also minimize teachers' time and effort. That's very important, yeah. Maybe we, we can use data and then maybe AI can support teachers' workloads to reduce the workload, yeah. And also, uh, learning analytics can optimize and provide personalized content and curriculum, like education system, by analyzing learning and teaching process data. Yeah. So, learning analytics is an a intersection between the learning and analytics. So, it's kind of the uh, uh, data science or artificial intelligence research field, but also learning and education research field is important, yeah. So we have to know the, what is the student performance and uh, student engagement, yeah, attitude, this kind of things. But, <laughs> but still, learning analytics very, is very difficult to do research because the, uh, there are many uh, human factors should be considered. <clears throat> yeah, so yeah, we need to uh, ask the teachers and the students and also the parents and also policy makers to involve <laughs> the research. Yeah, otherwise we cannot get data. And also we need to uh, develop some system, but uh, user interface is <laughs> important. If the, the design is not good, then no one uses it. And also we need to train the teachers and staff. Yeah. And also we have to think about privacy and ethical issues. So there are a lot of things to uh, think about. So, yeah. So what is the uh, learning analytics process? So first step, as a first step, we need to capture and record data. So most of the system we use uh, learning record stores uh, to record all the learning and teaching process, like a textbook reading process. And then we need to analyze data Maybe we, we need to create some models to predict something or to support some, uh, some people. Yeah. Okay, not only uh, just analyze data, but also after that we need to give the feedback to the students and teachers and also maybe parents. Yeah. yeah. So uh, most of the case we use a dashboard to visualize the result. Yeah, and then uh, after that, we, we should uh, evaluate the result. I mean, how the student or teacher's attitude change or something like that, yeah. Or, yeah, it's kind of the uh, uh, behavior changes or something like that. And then, uh, we need to uh, repeat this cycle again and again to improve the uh, whole the, uh, learning analytics process. Uh, 